was way before Made in Chelsea, the King's Road is where London's luxury lovers like to come and shop. We're here today to chat fashion, snoop in shopping bags and find out where the locals like to splash their cash. So I love your outfit today. Thank you. Can you talk us through it? Um, yeah, so I'm just wearing a very chilled out jumpsuit from American Apparel, wearing the leopard print shoes obviously because this is quite a plain outfit and I don't like to be plain. Then I've dressed it up with just like this which I took from my mum. My bag is this little Chanel sheepskin bag here, the little sheriff's badge on it. Um, so that's just a bit of luxury in the outfit. I'm more onto high street. I, I like classic things from, of course, uh, designer bits. To be honest, I always, the only one that I really go to is Brandy Melville. And I always go and just get plain t shirts because they're always really, really nice fabric. Um, and, and they're not as cheap as if you go to HM or somewhere, but I always think they're really soft, nice cotton. So just to get like staple tees, I'll go there. I'm wearing Topshop, um, the overcoat, um, Cesara, Doc Martens and um, a gift from my mum, Jumoshi. Very good mum. <laughs> She's a good mum, yeah. <laughs> I go to Zara, like a lot. I live in Zara, Brandy Melville. I get a lot of my stuff from Topshop. Uh, is there anything you're really looking forward to wearing this autumn? Um, definitely the sleeveless blazers that I'm seeing everywhere. The main trend which I missed out on last year was kilts. I loved it, it came and then it left and I never bought one and I regret it so I'm just praying I might come back in again. I'm going to go to Urban Outfitters in a bit and get some of those cool um, Calvin Klein sports bra things because um, I think they're quite nice to wear just like under like a big baggy top or, or something like that or even to work out in. Layering, I, I like big coats, long coats as well which I'm quite excited to wear again. Autumn or summer, what's your best season? Summer. If your body's good. <laughs> Is there anything that you really wish trend-wise had never seen the light of day? I always said that flares were never going to come back and they've just come back and I've just, <laughs> just made me look like a complete idiot. So. Well, I did have a pair of cord flares that were like a mustardy colour um, when I was about 17 and Actually, they were embarrassing and photographed quite a bit. And I wore them, I think, maybe for like a whole season. So they are everywhere and I can't escape them. So there you have it. The locals of the King's Road have certainly raised the fashion stakes for me. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Mode Stories UK, for more videos like this one. I'm off shopping now.